Millions, good morning. I've got the Halloween playlist going. I'm on an appointment that is a ways away from the house. Just wanted to start this off. Hope that you guys are having a wonderful day or have had a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys after the intro. As always, I sound so repetitive sometimes. Right over here, off to the right, down below this bridge, this overpass with all these pretty trees, is a place where Phoenix and Angie and I have hiked. You guys may remember that we've gone to Saltwater State Park and I'm in that area right now. It's down, the water's down over this way. But that is the second overpass that we hike back to, um, which is something that I just had a revelation about that now, uh, an epiphany. A mind warp, a mind gas, a mind blast. Uh, I just, I just remembered, thought about it, that that's where we hike up to because there's two bridges. Anyway, um, going back, uh, I've got one more appointment for the day, and then um, it's microwave oven installation day. Whoa, they're so clean. I said they're so clean. Oh, and slimy too. Look at that. They just slime right into position. Ew, that's gross. So, okay. And just cut the remaining, well, not the remaining, remaining. There's some small ones, but those are for the chicks. Um, let's see. Peppers from the garden. Seeds from the pumpkins. And because the chickens, obviously chickens poop. So there's poop over here. Um, <laughs> there was... Uh, the the gates on the side we just want to make sure that if something happens the wind blows them open or something like that that the chicks can't get out and the chicks are wreaking havoc in the garden you guys know that angie is out here trying to uh take care of stuff and they just wouldn't leave her alone <laughs> and they kept uh undoing what she was doing so yesterday when we were at uh lowe's we got some uh small t posts here so we're just going to fence off this section so this will be their section. This will not be their section. Party pooper. Who's a party pooper? Me? Yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um, but all the hard work that you did with all the gravel and everything is getting all well, messed up. That's not. That's supposed to grow over. That well, yeah, it's not supposed to be up here though. No, it's that's not. That's not supposed to be over there. Oh well, no, it's not. Okay. Party pooper. Okay. <laughs> this. Yeah. Oh my gosh, they ripped up this back section. They've been trying to get underneath a fence. Look at this. Whoever thought the chickens were that destructive? I didn't think that. Yeah, yeah. Anybody that hasn't had chickens. Okay, so this is what we're doing. Like I said, T posts, and we already got it roped, and they're pretty straight. So now we're going to get some of that chicken wire up. There. Quick and easy. No blood. So far? So far. Okay, they are now confined. We now have a uh, makeshift. Hope I don't offend anybody if I say a redneck fence that now separates the chick area from the garden. <laughs> so Angie's, oh my gosh, you did get all the beans. Oh, it's so sad. Look at this, it's so sad. It's naked over here now. I had every intent of getting this microwave installed today. So I go and I take the door off and I get all prepped up and everything. And, and then uh, I start taking a look at dimensions. Well, dimensions are a cabinet right here. From the back wall to here is what I say earlier, 14 and a quarter. Yeah, it's close to 15. Yeah, it's, it's pushing 15. Well, the microwave, if it, if the cabinet you're, I'm trying to find the paperwork from it. If the cabinet you're installing it in is a deep cabinet, deeper, deeper than, than 12 inch, no, deeper, than 14. deeper than 14, but between 12 to 14 inch, 12 minimum, 14 maximum, um, you need to get a bump out kit. That's a different bracket that does not get sold or sent with the unit. The unit does come with a bracket. It comes with quite a nice template. If you guys have ever installed a microwave. I don't know, but they all come with that. Well, no, you're right. Not, not all of them do. In fact, dude said a lot of them come with paper, but this is a template to use up top 
so that you drill your correct holes. And then this is also the mounting bracket that goes in the back. So it's dual purpose, which is tremendous. Unfortunately, we need the bump out, the bump out box part also. I feel like I'm talking about the chicken coop again with the bump out box. I don't think I have said bump out box in my lifetime as much as I have said it within the last year. <laughs> so, oh, hey, we got this done though. NG repainted the vent so it's gonna match the ceiling. Yay! We just have to get the screws done so that we can actually put it up there. I just need one more coat. Okay, all right. <laughs> so, that's not done today. The microwave's not done today. <sighs> okay, well, you know what I'm gonna do? Angie is fixing dinner. I am going to go shower, get some comfy clothes on, and call it a day. That's a good idea. That's a very good idea. And we got a fence up too. So I guess we did something. One of them still escaped. I know, well, I think she got in. The back of the chicken coop is still open. There's, you've got that fence piece there, but I think she wiggled her way. I think so. Through the, yeah, yeah. So, anyway. Buffy, are you hungry? Is that why you're sitting over there? Wishing, when you wish upon a dish, all your food comes true? <laughs> There's a Dr. Seuss book that talks about wishing and swishing for fish. Oh. You wish for a fish with a big swish swish and you get fish on your dish or something. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow, I'm glad you said dish. I thought you were going to say, no, okay, never oh. mind. I, yeah. Well, dude, did you see that look that... <laughs> You guys see these looks that she gives me before I see these looks, because I don't see them until I go and edit. Are you hungry? Yes. Are you hungry? Yes. Are you hungry? Yes. Are you hungry? Yes. Are you hungry? I don't want dog food though. Are you hungry? I'm gonna put this away. Order up that bracket that won't be here for like a week. And um Oh, and then we had a mantis. A mantis death today too. One of the five mantises died. Just the one that was in uh, this one right here. This one here molted though. Uh, Gimpy, Gimpy uh, molted and the mobility of his or her uh, arm hasn't come back 100%, but it's a little bit better than it was, I think. She can fly now, I gotta be careful. She's probably wanting to like sprout her wings. Oh my gosh, she's gotten so big. Look how beautiful she is. Wow. She got so big, she is so scary. No, she still doesn't have use of her arm though. Yep, she's still a little gimpy. In fact, I don't think it completely molted all the way either. Gotta be careful though now, cause she can fly. <laughs> all right, all right. I'm gonna do what I said I was gonna do. Oh, jeez. Oh, she hops too. Holy crap. Ah! <laughs> she can fly and she can hop. I relaxed a little bit, but more relaxing is necessary. So, guess what that means? Could mean many things. Bedtime? Almost, not quite. Watch a show? Yes. Have a snack? Yes. Okay. A snack. A snacky snack. Snacks. And we're gonna have a snack. And we're gonna watch a show. And then I wanna go to bed. <sighs> okay, that's it. Happy haunting. This See you guys is, tomorrow. This is Troy, what? Troy admitting that he needs some downtime. Look at that. I admitted something without admitting it. Therefore, I didn't actually but admit you it. Did. No, no, I never really You're did. You're drained. Hmm? You're drained. Um, then there's some, you know, little, I'm a little tired. Flu season is on us, so you need to stay healthy. Yeah. And in order to stay healthy, you need to stay rested. Rest. That sounds so nice right now. Okay. Bye, guys. See you tomorrow. Bye.